Hello, hello, everyone. My name's Paul Bauer. I'm a realtor here in the Lincoln Omaha area. And today with me, I have Sam and Vince. They are the owners and operators of the Coffee Roaster. How are you two doing today? We're good. Doing well. Yeah. Thanks for having us on. Yeah. Uh, did you know that there was going to be um, our 70th inch of snow over the overnight? Oh, is that what we're at? <laughs> <laughs> I just keep exaggerating it every time I do. Yes. <laughs> I'm going to be doing videos into July and still probably talking about snow because yes, take that long to stop. <laughs> the oh. snow doesn't bother me as much as the cold. Yes, uh, I was out shoveling this morning and my beard actually started to freeze. So oh, no. that's when you know it. You know it's time to go in and you know at least take a break. So yeah, I can relate. Yeah, exactly. Yes, yeah. <laughs> Finally, you know I have somebody that can relate. So. Um, well, you know, we'll get right into it. This is another bow tie business spotlight. And so first question that I have, tell us a little bit about yourselves and the business. Uh, go for it, Sam. Okay. So in 2014, my dad decided to retire from the coffee roaster, which he started in 1995. <clears throat> Excuse me. Um, he, yeah, he was retirement age and just was about ready to be done. And Vince was already working for him roasting. So it was kind of a natural progression into things. And yeah, we've just been run running it together ever since. Did you want to awesome. introduce yourself, Vince? <laughs> <laughs> sure, yeah, uh, I'm Vince. And uh, we got into the coffee roaster. I was working a job that I wasn't really too fond of. And Sam's dad said, hey, I'm, I'm thinking about retiring. And so we said, well, don't just shut it down. You'd have a lot of very upset customers. <laughs> yes. um, and so I quit my job and I went to start roasting for him. And that was, I don't even know how long ago. Well, 2014. 2014. <laughs> um, and so we've just kind of been gradually we shifted towards him uh, moving away from the business entirely and then Sam and I both coming in and and running it together awesome so obviously there's a little bit of a, a family tie-in with it because my next segue is how'd you get into the business so that's a little bit about it but if you could maybe go a little bit more into detail with that I guess we could talk kind of about how we changed things when we took over. My dad was really not into computers or anything, so we didn't have a website. So that was something we immediately started doing. And then each year, just kind of adding different things. We've updated the website, I think a couple of times. And this year during the pandemic, we have um, started a new website. We've implemented local delivery, curbside pickup. Um, what else? I know I'm missing some things. <laughs> We did like a live stream on Black Friday instead of having a lot of people come into the store. Vince also does live streaming, so kind of have multiple entrepreneurship <laughs> opportunities going on there. Right. Essentially just trying to uh, make it as easy as possible for customers to uh, get fresh roasted coffee, uh, whether that's us dropping it off at your door or swinging in for pickup or curbside or anything like that and trying to find new ways for us to uh, reach people in everybody's busy lives um, as they are. Gotcha. So you were, so you had a, another job and then you kind of came into the business and you said that you're a roaster and everything like that. How'd you kind of get into that? Were you like trained? Did you do training? Did you kind of just like learn it on your own? I know that's something I'm always interested in. Um, I know that uh, I, my wife and I have actually been to a different, a couple different, uh, like kind of small factories where they let you in and, you know, show you kind of how things are done and whatnot. And so I kind of consider myself a coffee connoisseur cause I love literally all kinds. Um, and so I've kind of dragged my wife into that as well. So how, how'd you kind of get into that aspects of it? Well, for me personally, it was just kind of a, an opportunity that presented itself when Sam's dad said that he was looking to get out of the business. And so I came and learned everything that he knew. He trained me initially. And then, uh, you know, YouTube 
did the rest. It's just a matter of hopping online and and learning from other people who have been doing it for for longer and, and different and unique techniques. Um, and you know, we we don't know everything there is to know. There's there's so many layers to coffee, uh, from you know the roasting to the brewing. We obviously focus more on the roasting side of things, uh, so we're constantly learning new things and uh, trying to implement our knowledge into what we do on a day-to-day -day basis. Um, so that's kind of where we are today. Awesome. Well, what these two are gonna do now is I'm going to have them share their screen and they are actually gonna take us on a little trip through their website here. Well, yeah, welcome to coffeeroasterlnk.com, which is our virtual storefront. Um, and where we send a lot of people, whether you're looking to learn more about what the coffee roaster is, or if you're wanting to place an order for local delivery, for shipment, or for pickup. Um, and so when you go to the website, this is the homepage, and this is uh, where, you'll, where you'll land and what you'll see first. And so obviously above, you can easily navigate to our shop section where you'll find coffee, tea, accessories, apparel, um, the local products that we offer um, in store, which is like Lulu B chocolates, uh, Dakobi skincare, cup of co, hot cocoa. Um, and then you can also learn more about partnering with us if you'd like to have us um, as your wholesale coffee provider. Uh, if Whether that you're a coffee shop, a office, a church, um, we work with a lot of different people who have a desire to have small batch fresh roasted coffee for their community or their employees. Right now, um, you can find us at New Vibe, Crescent Moon, Destinations Coffee Shop, Rabbit Hole Bakery. So since you can't get cups of coffee at our store, you can find our coffee around town. Yeah, that's something important to know is we are not necessarily your traditional coffee shop. Uh, we don't deal with anything that's espresso based or, or, you know, drink related. Uh, we primarily focus on the bean. Um, and that was actually Sam's dad's motto uh, when the he bean, started. The bean, the whole bean and nothing but the bean. <laughs> so, um, so yeah, to navigate the website, it's super easy. We wanted to make sure that anybody could understand it. Like I said, up here, you can kind of click through the different uh, dark roast, decaf, light roast, the different types of tea we have. If you scroll down, you'll see the same menus that exist uh, for the different coffees we have. Right now, we were highlighting uh, Lulu B chocolates uh, because Valentine's Day is definitely a chocolate heavy day. Um, and so we're constantly uh, changing the site to make it easier to navigate so you can find what's relevant as fast as possible. Um, that also goes to then our blog, which we haven't really fully developed into what we want it to be ultimately. But right now we have one blog post which talks about joining our rewards program. So that's one thing with the, the new website, this is a fairly new website for us that we built into it is a really robust rewards program because when a customer supports us, we, we want to let them know how much that means to us. And the best way to do that is by giving them an opportunity to earn free coffee or money off anything that they buy in the future. So to dive into the rewards program, you can either head over to the blog and read this uh, initial blog post that we did, or if you're already pretty techn technically savvy, you can just click this little rewards program button in the corner, uh, which lets you join now. And then every time you purchase anything, whether that's beans, uh, tea, shirts, uh, you earn what are called beans. So it's kind of our, our own currency. Um, and as you see here, ways to earn, you get money or you get beans for just signing up, placing an order, liking on Facebook. Uh, whenever it's your birthday, you get 500 beans. And so how our beans program work is you get 10 beans for every dollar that you spend. And at 500 beans, you get $5 off, 1,000 beans, $10 off, 1,500 beans, $15 off, and so on. So it's very simple and it's also very easy to earn uh, money off uh, pretty quick. 
Um, and that's something that we've always wanted to do. We used to do a punch card program, but that turned out to be a very difficult thing to manage in the midst of a pandemic. Uh, so we kind of digitized all of that uh, through this awesome rewards program. Obviously you can contact us uh, with this button up here, either Sam or I, uh, this goes directly to our email. So if you have any questions, comments, um, let us know, we'd love to hear from you. Uh, the wholesale process is also very similar to where um, it's just a contact form at this moment where you can let us know what your business name is, uh, tell us a little bit more about you know, why you want to become or why you want to partner with us in wholesale. And uh, we would absolutely love to do that. And I think that's about it. It's a pretty simple website. We wanted to keep it, um, you know, nice, pretty, easy to navigate. I suppose I could, uh, here, I'll click on one of the copies so you can see that. So when you click on Dark Roast, you see uh, the copies that exist here. You can click on Quick View, which pops up a window that uh, allows you to add different sizes. You choose your grind setting uh, without having to open new windows. But if you want to learn more about the coffee, you can actually click through and see a little detailed description and then other similar products. And I think that covers it. Cool. Well, that is awesome. Uh, I think that's probably one of the most developed uh, websites that I've seen that, I mean, just the way kind of uh, section by section, you know, it really did flow. And I think one of the things that's really cool is I don't think you could quote unquote, get away with the type of community you actually have on your website, like you would in a lot of other places. Um, you know, a lot of different coffee shops, you know, Lulu's, you know, all these different areas that you're able to help and whatnot. And, you know, it is, it's, it's kind of cool that your website kind of is a, its own little community. Definitely. And we want to create more of that community uh, by, you know, moving, moving toward posting more blogs and uh, other video content and things like that. So if you're watching this right now and you have any ideas for us on how we could create content uh, that would get you to interact a little more with the website that would be valuable to you, let us know in the comment section. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> um, so obviously, you know, you have a lot of different support and everything. Uh, you kind of touched on them on the website or anything. Uh, do you have any um, people that are your personal support, any businesses you're partnered with? Um, agency 877 helped us with this website. Um, okay. trying to think who else. Yeah. I mean, a lot of different businesses, uh, there's a really cool, um, it's kind of like a dental laboratory that exists here in town and they provide fresh roasted coffee to all of their employees. Oh, cool. Um, High Society Cheesecake, as Sam was going through the different wholesalers, Crescent Moon, New Vibe, oh, yeah, Rabbit Donut Hole, Hole Bakery, Donut Hole. I know I'm forgetting some. Um, yeah, the, the list is pretty long and, and that's great. Um, not only does it, not only are you able to provide a good product to the people that are, are working with, around your sphere, but uh, it also allows us to get to learn more about you and to grow our, our little community as well, so. We value every one of our wholesale customers uh, so much because they help us keep keep the lights on. Yeah, for sure. Well, just kind of wrapping it up, is there is there kind of one thing related to your business or Lincoln that you're kind of looking forward to? Let's both do one. What are you looking forward to? Um, oh, gosh. Don't steal mine. <laughs> We'd like to get back into doing classes, but if we can't do them in person, we'll do them virtually, but we just haven't. We've been able to hire another full-time person so we can focus more on the fun stuff like doing classes, but that just has been on the back burner for a long time. Definitely. Is that's, that what you were going to say? No, but that's in the pipeline. That is yeah. something I'm excited about. Um, for me, I'm excited about now that we have this website developed, it's working, it's working well, people are understanding it. Uh, the next phase for us is to start to do subscriptions. Oh, yeah. And mm -hmm. so we're actually going to build out a subscription service that includes free or very cheap local delivery. 
So you can kind of think of us like the coffee milkman. Um, <laughs> you're able to choose the frequency at which you want coffee quite literally dropped off at your doorstep. So you know that you're always drinking fresh roasted coffee. Um, and we're going to try to build that into the website to where you can change the type of coffee that you want uh, from week to week. Or if you're one of our many Panama lovers and you just want to make sure that you've got that cup of coffee without having to worry about leaving your house or running out, uh, that's something that we're going to be building into the website very, very soon. Yeah, it does sound like a good opportunity for a lot of people. Yeah. Well, with that, I definitely appreciate you both being on here. Um, I learned a lot about coffee and the bean and it's mm -hmm. only about the bean <laughs> um, but uh, I really appreciate you guys doing this and uh, I will make sure to send a lot of people including businesses to the website so we can kind of keep building that community please thanks do for having us on yeah thanks for having us no problem